So most of the videos I made are in the small greenhouse where I've been growing vertically in the towers. But what I want to share with you are some of the photos of the commercial farm where we grow in the ground. As you can see, we've got a lot of greenhouses, but we also have some acreage where we grow in the field. One of the problems we've been having in the greenhouses, as well as in the field, is nematodes. And here you can see some of the damage that nematodes are causing with the root structure. So every year what we do is we would take the dirt out of the greenhouse and bring, go down to the creek bed, dig up new dirt, bring it in to try to control the um, nematode problem that we had. And of course that's time consuming and it's expensive. In the field, as you can see, right now I'm standing in the okra patch and you can see these roots on the okra here are full of nematodes. <clears throat> now we didn't treat this uh, field this year because how we treat it is very effective but it also there's an expense involved in treating it and we just didn't have the money to treat the field uh, so we spent our effort in treating the greenhouses since that's where most of our cash crops are grown. Our secret is pretty simple. Uh, on the internet one day I was reading doing some research and I came across an article that talked about worm castings eliminating nematodes and so we thought we'd give it a whirl and so you can see by this photo here this is a structure or a photo of a tomato plant where we treated it with worm castings and you can see there's no nematodes and so we did that we bought a couple thousand pounds of worm castings and we put it with each plant as we set each plant out and sure enough it basically eliminated our nematode problem. And so not only eliminated the nematodes, but it also helped the plant grow. We bought our worm castings from a company called Sunrise Worm Castings. And um, I'll post their information at the end of the video, like I always post our vendor information where we buy stuff. So I hope you've enjoyed the slideshow and be sure and subscribe and stay tuned because I will keep putting out videos, hopefully that will be beneficial to you.